I think that's the best advice I've gotten so far. <laughs> we are so good at this. <laughs> Welcome everyone, this is Novel Advice and I am Josiah. Today with me I have... Juliet Capulet. A pleasure to set this scene with you. And... Katniss Everdeen. Hello. I wanted to learn from you guys, what do I have to do in order to find love? Find someone who, at first you believe, nay. Thou dost not belong here, but then gaze into their eyes uh -huh. and see a depth the likes of which the ocean is jealous. I, you know, to start. How about you, Katniss? You just find someone who can feed you. As a great bard once said, different strokes for different folks. What's the difference between liking someone and loving them? I guess someone who loves you won't kill your sister. I have a love who killed my cousin, and it is fine. I met a really kindred soul the other day. Yeah. <sighs> really beautiful. I, I, I want to tell her that I really, really like her. How should I go about it? I guess you could run through the forest and get stung by a thousand mutant bees or stand in the middle of a square and get beaten so you're within an inch of your life, or just constantly be, be tortured and brainwashed until you don't even remember who your love is and then try to kill her, and then find your way back to her. And that, that really shows that you love someone. So you guys seem to know a lot about relationships. I was wondering if you guys are in a relationship right now. Ooh, ooh, may I speak first? May I speak first? Go ahead. Oh, yay. Um, so, my beautiful Romeo. Oh, Romeo. He hath hair like a swirl of dark clouds, but instead of bringing a thunderstorm, it brings the kind of thunder that booms across across the land. Romeo is part of the Montagues, and I, of course, am part of the Capulets. Mm. And, well, when you, uh, uh, let's look at the term blood feud. Now, it was simply upon seeing Romeo, my heart galloped a pace like fiery-footed steeds towards the Phoebus's lodging of his heart. I simply knew in an intrinsic way. It was more than his vestment. It was more than his face, but it was a feeling, a, almost a soul connection, mm -hmm. I would say. Um, and also, I suppose one might also say it helped that he was objectively um, a, a, a hotter. Oh. Which era are you from? That is a great question. <laughs> <Cut>. <laughs>